Welcome to a tutorial on how to evaluate a derivative of an implicit equation on the TA-89 graphing calculator. Here we're asked to determine the slope of the tangent line to the curve at the indicated point. We'll be using the implicit differentiation function located under the calculus menu in order to answer these questions. Let's begin by pressing F3 for the calculus menu. The implicit differentiation function is the last option in this menu, so let's press up instead of down. So here we have the implicit differentiation function, so we'll press enter. And now we'll enter the equation, comma, the independent variable, comma, the dependent variable. And because we determine the slope of the tangent line using the y dx, x is the independent variable, and y is the dependent variable. So for this first problem, we'll enter x raised to the power of 2 plus y raised to the power of 2 equals 25 and then comma x comma y. We can leave off the order because we're looking for the first derivative. And the first derivative is the default for this function. So we enter close parenthesis. If we press enter now, we would get dy dx, which we see here. But we can also evaluate the derivative at this point by going back to the previous entry. So we'll press the right arrow, and then we'll press this vertical bar and enter x equals negative 3 and y equals 4. So x equals negative 3. Now we'll go to the catalog for and. So catalog, press down once for the and, press enter, and now we enter y equals 4. And enter, and notice how it gives us the value of the derivative at the point negative 3 comma 4 is 3 fourths, which we can easily check by performing substitution into the derivative function dy dx. So we now know the slope of the tangent line to the curve at the point negative 3 comma 4 is 3 fourths. Let's look at another example. Let's go through the process again. So we'll press F3 for the calculus menu, up for implicit differentiation, enter. Next we'll enter the equation, so x raised to the power of 2. And when we enter x, y, we need to enter x times y. So plus x times y plus y raised to the power of 2 equals 3, comma, the independent variable is x, comma, the dependent variable is y, close parenthesis. Again, if we press enter now, the calculator gives us dy dx. We want to evaluate the derivative at the point 1, comma 1. So let's use the previous entry. We'll press the right arrow, then the vertical bar, x equals 1. For and, we go to the catalog. Notice and is already selected, so we'll press enter. And we enter y equals 1. And enter. The y dx is equal to negative 1 at the point 1, comma 1, which means the slope of the tangent line at the point 1, comma 1 is negative 1. So we have m equals negative 1. I hope you found this helpful.